Hi friends, it's a lovely afternoon out there and I'm craving some sugar after my lunch. So with my coffee, I'm going to bake some carrot cake to go. Enjoy this video. I'm going to begin by mixing my brown sugar and my eggs. I'm going to add the brown sugar in a big bowl. My eggs mixed with some vanilla essence. And I'm going to mix these two. I'm going to now put oil into this. And whisk it through nicely. This cake is good for winters, for tea time and it's really healthy so you can give it to your kids too. I'm now going to add flour into this. Some baking powder. Some cinnamon powder. And of course the carrots. Carrots are not available around the year, so I don't leave any opportunity when they come in the season to bake this cake. Scrape all the sides of the bowl, all the way to the bottom, and it's done. I'm going to put this in a pan, which I've already lined with butter paper and greased it with some fat. I have a pan here, I've put butter and then butter paper. I'm going to pour it in and level it out and bake. Just going to roughly level this out. Bake it at 170 degrees for 30 to 35 minutes. My carrot cake is out of the oven and I've taken it out of the mold and cooled it down for about 45 minutes. I have some cream cheese frosting here that I'm going to pour on the top. For this recipe of the cream cheese frosting, follow the link that appears on your screen. Since my cake is still a little warm, the cream cheese frosting will flow out on the sides. I'm going to finish this by sprinkling some ginger powder on the top. You can also add ginger powder inside the cake, it's optional. Ginger powder, nutmeg, star anise and the carrot cake is ready to go. Let's slice it and eat it. Do try this recipe at home and I shall wait to hear from you about it. Don't forget to subscribe to India Food Network and watch this space for more videos.